Good afternoon. This is Paul Bazard with Business Network Television. Uh, we're broadcasting on at 38 TV from Studio A, Distillery 98, and lovely Santa Rosa Beach, Florida. And uh, this is a show where we connect businesses to businesses and businesses to consumers wherever we can. Yeah. And I've got a great guest today. His name is Gary White, and he is with <laughs> High Definition yeah. uh, Coaching. Coaching, that's <laughs> it. That's it. You got nice, it. Nice to meet you, Gary. Good Thank to, you so much. Yeah, and uh, thanks, thanks for coming on the yeah, show. Now, Gary, you, uh, I read a little bit about you, and uh, you have uh, an affiliation with the John Maxwell method of coaching now yeah. i i gotta confess yeah. i gotta confess to you i had not heard of john maxwell until i did my research after knowing that you were <laughs> part of that so uh tell us a little bit about john maxwell how you got involved and really what is it yeah so thanks for asking that question paul yeah, yeah john maxwell is the number one leadership guru in the world if you if you google john maxwell if you google leadership you'll see john maxwell's name come up. Uh, he's he's mentored and coached Paul, uh, NFL, Chick-fil-A, NASCAR, mm -hmm. on and on and on, on and on. Fortune 500 companies, Fortune 1000 companies. He's written more on leadership than anyone in history. So I guess in that way he's probably made history, I guess, Paul. Well, now one of my little, th <laughs> little pieces of research is that he sold over 30 million books. Yeah, yeah. Like 30 million? Yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I know some successful authors and that's yeah. a lot. Yeah, John's flagship book, Paul, is The 21 Irrefutable Laws of Leadership. Mm -hmm. They're irrefutable. They transcend every cultural boundary in the world. Uh, for instance, the law of the lid, that the leader is the lid of the organization. Mm -hmm. And if, if the leader only grows to this high, only grows to this much, the organization cannot grow mm -hmm. above the level of the leader. Yeah, but the good news sense. is the leader, you can lift your lid. Yeah. You can get better. <laughs> and you would think that they, I know somebody that wants to be a leader yeah. also does want to improve and, ha and have set that bar a little yeah. higher for them and their company. Otherwise, yeah. why do it? Absolutely. Yeah, because really the only guarantee, Paul, that that uh, today gets, uh, tomorrow gets better is that we get better today. Mm -hmm. If we get better today, if you get better today, that's the guarantee that your business, that your life is going to get better tomorrow. Indeed. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. So. How did you get involved with John, or how did you hear about him? And, and, and now, look, you're on stage with him, yeah. uh, which I see a couple of the photographs here, and, and which, I mean, it looks as though you've also become a public speaker, yeah. and uh, you're speaking very well today, so yeah, yeah that's absolutely. pretty cool. Yeah, so, Paul, I've been reading John's books for probably about 12 years. A mentor of mine introduced me to John. Mm. And uh, so after reading John's books for about 12 years, I noticed that John had a team. He had developed a team within the John Maxwell Enterprise of coaches mm -hmm. where you could be certified to bring John's material, uh, to take John's material into the workplace, into the marketplace, mm -hmm. into the corporate space, mm -hmm. wherever. And uh, so I knew John wouldn't lead me wrong, no pun intended. <laughs> uh, so I, uh, I, I came to that point in my life where I knew I needed to make that, needed right. to make that choice. And so I did. Yeah. And I learned then, Paul, that I was pretty good at, at helping others. Mm. I stunk at growing myself. Mm -hmm. uh, not being intentional with growing yourself, John Maxwell says, mm. that that's very much like a farmer takes a pail and a stool and sits in the, in the barnyard and waits on the cows to come to him. <laughs> It does. That's, it doesn't work. Well, unless they've got, unless he's got <laughs> something to feed him with, they probably won't make a move. Yeah, you got to be intentional if you're going to grow personally. And when you grow personally. That manifests itself in meaningful change. I don't think there's anyone that got out of bed this morning that's watching us, Paul, that doesn't want some kind of meaningful change in their life. I don't think they went to work saying, I think I'm okay with mediocre. I think I'm okay sure. with, with just staying at this level or basically on a little downward slide. I don't think there's anybody that really wants that. Yeah, for right, sure. For right. sure. <laughs> so t talk to us a little bit about, now I see Paraguay in there. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, I'm assuming that's... You didn't just wear the shirt. Didn't just wear the shirt. Yeah. Yeah. So we're, was that like a convention or what was going on there? Yeah. Good question. Uh, so John, John's latest book is change your world. Now John has sold millions as you, as you talked about millions and millions of books. His flagship is the 21 laws, but John says that change your world. That's his heartbeat. As a matter of fact, mm -hmm. he said these words, he said, I would die for this. I would die for this. That's wild. This, what you're seeing in that picture, Paul, is is uh, the result of the president of Paraguay asking John, will you bring your coaches 
And will you come help us do transformation in our country? Will you come help us do that? Wow, a whole country. Yeah. That's yeah. big. So I had the opportunity to go into uh, their, their federal government and, and train the trainers. Go into mm -hmm. a supermarket and the leaders within the supermarket industry, wow. yeah. uh, within a university and a hospital even. Yeah. And it was just a just an amazing transformational experience. Uh, uh, you'll notice on, on the shirt there where it says transformation mm -hmm. uh, está en mí. It begins mm -hmm. in me. Transformation. It starts with me. So John, through Change Your World, and you can go to changeyourworld.com mm -hmm. and you can actually become a facilitator of value-based roundtables, Paul. You don't have to be a coach of John Maxwell's to do that. It, it, it is free, but you can go to changeyourworld.com and, and become a facilitator of these transformation tables. John said, great, wonderful that other countries are asking us to come there. Mm -hmm. We need it right here. We need it right sure. here. Yeah, exactly. You know, we need it right here in our town. In our no, city. I think that's, you know, it sounds to me like a great catalyst for when, uh, yeah. you know, if you're being invited to a, a different country and then he's like, well, I can do the same here. Yeah, and so on. absolutely. So um, yeah. tell us a little bit about uh, high definition coaching and how that feeds into what you're doing. Yeah. And especially just as you, you know, talked on local, you're yeah. in the local Panama City area yeah. here, and, and uh, obviously we're, we're obviously we're on 30A here, uh, uh, which is a scenic highway in yeah. Florida, northwest Florida. Uh, tell us a little bit about uh, HDC. HDC, yeah, high definition coaching. I, I I gave it that name, Paul, because there's standard definitions that we all operate by. They they're just are. I've I've got my standard definition on what's possible, opportunity, how much I can grow, how much I can't grow. We've mm -hmm. got standard definitions. But all of our hopes and dreams, all the things that we're reaching for, we're reaching for them because they're not within our reach. Mm -hmm. And many times they're outside of our standard definitions, our frame of reference. Paul, I would say that whenever you had the idea for 30A TV, there's probably many things that you didn't see that it would evolve into and that it would grow mm -hmm. into. There's probably things that you didn't see up front, the value that it would become. But it was reaching outside of that original frame of reference. So that's why... We call it high definition. If you're yeah. not, if it's not in the standard For definition, sure. it's in high definition. It's outside of those limitations. For sure, the things that would limit. Yeah, thirty eight TVs. Sometimes I call it a little bit of schizophrenic. We're over <laughs> here, and then we're over there, and then we're doing comedy, and then we're doing something else. And yeah, and uh, but at the end of the day, you know, I always, I always like to interact with other businesses yeah. and find out what they're doing and tell a little bit about their story. And that's yeah. kind of part of the the point of this show is to connect with somebody. You know, hopefully somebody's watching out there that says, well. I want to know more about Gary and right. what he's doing, and maybe I can help my company. Yeah. And, uh, you know, that's so where would that start with you? Like, obviously, with a phone call and maybe a consultation. Yeah, absolutely. As to how, okay, what, how can we help each other? Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. So it really begins with a discovery session, a discovery meeting of what, what are your gaps? What are your challenges? Where is it that you really want to go? What I found that, that is a very big area of need in most places. Two, two primary areas, Paul. One is communication, mm -hmm, right? For sure. Because right? if you ever see a conflict between people, someone says, mm -hmm. well, I don't see it that way. Mm -hmm. And they say that because they don't see it that way. Yeah. There's a, it's a different perspective. For sure. And whenever you can help people understand those perspectives, right. understand those preferences, then uh, things just begin to go smoothly. Yeah. The other area is leadership development. Another problem that we found in the marketplace, Paul, is that uh, there are those that are really good at what they do, and, and because they're good at what they do, they say, hey, let's, let's move them into a leadership position. Mm -hmm. And yet, if there's not any leadership development content, if there's not any leadership development there, yeah. then they're doing the best they know how. They're yeah. doing the best that maybe maybe the best they know how is they've seen what they didn't like. Right? Yeah, yeah. And they well, let me just do the opposite. Right. Yeah. Uh, but this is where this is where we have the opportunity to take the number one leadership guru in the world and bring the highest level cutting edge leadership development material and training modems straight to you, straight straight to those that, that want to use this as a prerequisite even mm. for management. Yeah. Well, that's pretty valuable to have, uh, yeah. you know, something of your caliber in this area. And uh, I think it's pretty unique. <laughs> and uh, I was looking at that, the, the, uh, the, the image that's behind my, behind my head right now. So yeah. you're actually traveling with John yeah. to events and so on. Do you have anything yeah. coming up that you might, uh, you, that you might want to talk about? Yeah, so I'll be with John in Orlando in August at the uh, another one of our International Maxwell conferences. 
this is also opportunity for those that that want to become a coach like i've done that mm. hey i'd like to be a coach for mm. john maxwell i'd like i'd like to know how i can make that kind of difference and use my gifts in that way and so there are those that will come to that and they'll actually be certified through that mm -hmm. and also it serves as an opportunity for us to come together with john um, we'll have Dave Ramsey with us this time. We've, we've had uh, Seth Godin. Mm -hmm. We've had uh, Paul Sheely, on and on and on. Just uh, uh, Carly Fiorina, just wonderful, wonderful people mm -hmm. uh, thinking at such high levels. And we get all this extra time with John of his teaching and mentoring into our life. And we get all this extra time with these guests of John that he brings in. Mm -hmm. And we get to spend intimate e extra time with them. Yeah. So it is uh, the growth. Yeah. It's there for the taking, right? You yeah, just got to get sure. yourself in the room. Just get yourself well, in the room. Absolutely. Yeah. So now, would there be some one particular part of, of John's method that you would kind of say, okay, this this is your go-to start here? Yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. I, I So I would say the Maxwell method of communication impact. Mm -hmm. Right? So there, the, there, there's this. There's Maxwell method of sales. There's Maxwell mm -hmm. method of leadership. Maxwell method of speaking. He's he's the highest paid non-political speaker on the on the planet, right? Mm -hmm. So there's there's that, right? How he can mm -hmm. help you be a better speaker. Maxwell method of coaching, which is amazingly transformational. But I would say that that first area, the Maxwell method of communication impact, and he calls it that for a reason because mm -hmm. the way that I communicate to you, Paul, the way that the way we yeah, communicate sure. to one another, it's going to have an impact. Yeah. One way or the other, it's going to have an impact. And the way that I can really connect with you is in the way that matters most to you. Mm -hmm. So I've got, I just need to make it about you, right? <laughs> I just need to make well, it know, about you. Yeah. I know that's one of the, one of John's uh, definite, uh, you know, things is that when he's, when he is sp speaking, you know, or suggesting that you speak to people yeah. is that it's, you know, definitely don't make it about, you know, what I've done and, and, you know, <laughs> talk about yourself for 20 minutes. Like uh, <laughs> we can all sleep to that. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Well, this is fascinating yeah, stuff, yeah. and I, I know obviously, yeah. I, you know what we'd like to do is maybe have you on again and talk a Absolutely. little bit about one of the segments of yeah. that. So, uh, how can people uh, get in touch with you at the moment? Yeah, so you can reach out to me at Gary at High Definition Coaching dot com. Kind of long, I know. Gary <laughs> at High Definition Coaching dot com. Good. We'll put that on yeah. the screen after editing. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and is there a phone number or anything like that? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Sure. Okay, great. Yeah, area code four two three. Five nine three eight zero zero three, and that'll get you straight to me. Awesome! I'll uh, I'll we'll stick that on the screen and and have that so we can so uh, so everybody can see it. And Gary, it's been a pleasure. I mean, uh, you, I'm fascinated to know more. And yeah. and uh, you know, let's uh, let's continue the conversation. Yeah. Well, thank you. Appreciate Paul. it. Yeah. Thanks so thank much you for the opportunity. Yeah, and thanks to Shannon. We have to give a yeah. shout out to Shannon That's before right. we go at the chamber so that we can tag her uh, and she's super helpful putting people Absolutely. together she works yeah. with the Panama City Chamber I'm a pleasure uh, glad to be a member there and I'm sure Gary is too Absolutely it's yeah. uh, it's a wonderful chamber you yeah. know members talk to members before they kind of go outside you know support a member before uh, you know give them an opportunity yeah. if it's air conditioning or something like that um, it's a little hot in here. That's why I brought that up. Um, you know, give, give a member a chance before you kind of go elsewhere. So, uh, yeah. that's, uh, it, although I, the first point of contact is always with Shannon. Cause if yeah. you text her and say, Hey, I need this. She'll be like, boop, talk to so-and-so. Yeah. It's amazing. So anyway, yeah. uh, Paul Bizarre, you can see more videos like this, uh, at 38.tv and, uh, you can download all our apps and you can see our syndication. You can actually watch 24-7 live at 30alive.com. And we'll see you next time, Business Network Television. Thanks so much.